Hey everybody, it's Dennis from AndroidBugle.com here, and we have another video test for you. This time around, we're going to take the same four phones, and instead of playing a YouTube video through the YouTube app, we're going to play the, uh, the same video on all four phones using the in-browser Flash player. So, we're going to see uh, how good each one of these phones can handle Flash. So, one would assume that the dual-core Motorola HX 4G should do pretty well. And um, there was a video put out by Qualcomm uh, talking about their mobile development uh, platform, I believe it's called the MDP, and basically it's um, their dual core um, development uh, handset that they've developed for developers who want to get a head start on uh, optimizing their apps for the Qualcomm platform. And in that demo they were talking about the single core uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon being able to outperform the competitors dual core offerings. Now of course that naturally means that they were taking a shot at Nvidia so I sort of thought that that was a little bit of odd, a little bit odd rather and wanted to see my for myself if that was really the case so we've got four phones here uh, just so you get a good idea of what's going on. We've got the Samsung Galaxy S 4G here, and we've got the Motorola Atrix here, the HTC Incredible S here, and the Sony Xperia Arc here. So we're going to try to get these videos running at the same time, and we'll see which one gives the best performance. Uh, all four videos are running at 720p, and this is using the again this is using the Flash player inside the browser. So all the phones have been updated with the latest version of Flash 10.3. And here we go. Guys, Michael Bolton is here. Oh, great. Send him in. Hey, guys. Hey, how are you doing? I'm really sorry I'm late. I just got caught up watching the Pirates of the Caribbean marathon. Have you seen those things? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Those, are, those are great. Well, I listened to your track, and I loved it. And I wrote you this big, sexy hook. Wow, that's great. You want to just lay it down? Boys, let's get to it, to it, to it. Here we go. Oh, Holy Island, Michael Bolton. Yeah! It's time to get on the track. The boys are back. The night starts now. It starts now, baby. Roll with us. Check it snapping at the neck. We're rolling up. There's ain't no holding up. So as you can see, I think we can get a pretty good indication of which uh, phone is able to handle 720p flash content the best on, you know, inside a browser. And obviously, it's the HTC Incredible S. In Qualcomm's demo, they were using a My Touch 4G to show the 720p flash capabilities of their phone versus a dual core and what's led to believe is uh, that they used a T-Mobile G2X using the NVIDIA Tegra 2 and as you can see here the results are just about the same so you know, frame rates are much better on the HTC Incredible S which leads me to, to believe that um, HTC and Snap and uh, Qualcomm rather have been working together to optimize for their platform because the Sony Xperia Arc is also touting the same uh, chipset and hardware as the Incredible S, but yet you can see just by this video that the Incredible S is just heads uh, above the rest. Like it, it, it's not even close. The video is fluid. You can watch it, enjoy it. Whereas on the three other phones, it's a little bit of a slideshow. So that was our test of Flash inside the browser. This is Dennis from AndroidBugle.com signing off. Check out the site for more information.